What's up guys, it's Chad here with G-Reviews, coming to you from my driveway today. I'm doing an update on something I did a review on two months ago. As you can see here, Dura Dressing from Dura Coating Technologies. I don't know if you remember, but two months ago I made a review on how to install it the proper way and my initial thoughts. And today I'm going to reveal what the tire looks like and if I think it's going to last longer. Here we go. Here is the reveal in the shade. I'm going to back my wife's van out into the sun and I'm going to show you what it looks like in the sun. I just moved my wife's van out into the sun and here it is. As you can see it actually has a nice amount of shine still left on the tire. Hopefully the wind's not too bad in the, in the microphone. But this is the tire dirty. I'm going to do a demo real quick, show you guys me washing it so you, so you can tell that it's still looking good. Once you have dirt dressing on your tires, you don't want to use anything that's going to have any acidity or you know base to it. So you don't want to use any harsh tire, tire cleaners, any wheel cleaners, anything on the actual coating itself because it might degrade the coating. So this is what I just use in general for the auto paint and what I use for wheels and tires. Chemical guys, honeydew snow foam pH neutral so you know you're not going to get any sort of uh, chipping or etching of the coating. Alright I'm going to go to uh, on to washing. Standard garden hose. Uh, you can probably use a pressure washer but I'm just going to use standard garden hose because I know I'm not going to be again trying to chip off coating so just if you want to get it all wet. Knock off anything loose on there. Alright. I just use, this is a um, Chemical Guys, just soft hair brush. Start at the top, work your way down. Again, this is just to knock off any dirt, anything that's on the actual coating itself. I'm not trying to scrape off anything or just kind of a maintenance car wash. I'm gonna do the wheel in a separate uh, separate video, but uh, just trying to get the uh, tires all clean for you. All right, got that all clean. I'm going to get my um, gonna get my dryer, dry it real quick for you, and see what it looks like. The tire is finally done drying. I went around and I washed the whole van. As you can see, it still looks really shiny. This is the original two coats I put on two months ago. It's still shiny, still holding strong. There's a slight browning of the tire. Uh, again, this is my wife's van. I'm not sure if she really hits curves or bangs anything. It kind of looks like there's a little bit of a scuff mark on this side over here and as you can see on the edge still holding strong maybe right on the edge it's kind of flakes off I guess it all depends on tire pressure and things but or how hard my wife corners I'm gonna walk to the back one again these are put on the same day consecutive times this one right here still looking really good all right so I'm not going to be applying any more uh, dirt dressing yet I'm going to give it another month or another two months depending when it actually starts looking not so good again I'm going to give it another coat but right now it's still holding on strong and it's looking real shiny. 